Welcome, Cliff. <gasps> what As the? Am I, you know, this is his fifth career start, and he's shown some real potential so far. Here we go again. <laughs> Live from Studio B, this. Is Talk Show with your host. Thank you, thank you. Seriously, thank you. Welcome to Talk Show. I'm your host. And thanks for joining us for season two here. Yeah. It's going to be an exciting season. Man, I am killing it so far. Those streamers, balloons, you kidding me? This season is going to be lit. I really hope this crowd likes my banana joke. So then he asked me, is that a banana in your pocket? No, it's a banana split. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. Hey, wait a sec. I'm doing an inner monologue during my monologue. Whoa! All right, looks like I'm wrapping it up here. Let's check out what we got on this show. We got a great show for you tonight, folks. We got a very special guest. I'm not going to reveal it now, but you've met him before, and we're going to play a few games. So please stick around. We'll be right back. Ugh, I don't know. These things kind of freak me out. <laughs> Are you scared of it? You do. I got this. Okay. <laughs> Don't risk it with store-bought cinnamon rolls. Come on down to Super Buns. Conveniently located at the Lilydale Mall. Shop now, shop forever. Lilydale Mall. Thank you, thank you. Welcome back to Talk Show. I'm your host. For our first guest today, we got a real popular guy coming back. You all know him, and so I don't need to introduce him at all, but here it goes. Please welcome Time Traveler Guy. How you doing, man? Good, good to see you. I thought you were going to get your little grand entrance here, but you just walking on stage? Oh, I got here a couple hours early. Just went shopping for a little bit. Oh, okay, yeah. I, not this outfit, though. No, no, definitely from the future. <laughs> right, I think I could have guessed that. Um, looks nice, though. I really like it. Thank you. All right, well, we didn't just bring him on to chit-chat, to get to know him. I think you all know this. We're here to play a little game. If you don't mind, I'm going to tell him what we're going to do here. Well, I already know. I'm a time traveler, so go ahead and help out the audience. All right, thank you. Okay, so we are going to graciously use Time Traveler Guy's time machine and go to three different locations in time, and I have to guess, when am I? And that's about it. Let's do it. All right. Wow, spiffy time machine you got here. I know. Company vehicle, benefits are excellent. And it's great. I really like it. Well, how about we get this started up, okay? Of course, I'm ready. All right, we're going to travel to our first location. Here we okay, go. Okay, yep. Okay, black and white, old-timey vehicles. I mean, you're giving me an easy one early on here. 1956. Actually, that's wrong. We're in the future right now. What? Absolutely. No color. Don't need it. The world voted. No color. Wow. Simpler, I guess. Mm -hmm. Old-timey vehicles, though. I mean... You gotta bring the classics back every couple thousand years. You're right. You're always right. Hey, when I'm right. You're right. Yep. All right, let's go to the next one. Here okay. we go. Here we go. Oh, ancient Egypt. Whoa. Aliens, please tell me this isn't happening right now. This is happening right now. No. We just went here. No. Mm -hmm. Well, I, it's got to be 4,022. Wrong again. <sighs> it's actually ancient Egypt, my friend. What? Yeah. Well, how else do you think they were built? 
Yeah. All right, your host. We're going round three here. Yeah. You're going to get this one. Oh, boy. All right, we're here. Okay, I, this is right in my wheelhouse. Notice, everyone, the Cathedral Dome. Down here, we've got segmented arches. It's got a real classical antiquity feel, but with a little high renaissance, a little Italian. I'm putting my money on 1467. Not bad, but notice the Marion columns. Yeah. We've got rectangular arches here. Yeah. It's a, it's a classical design, just with some added complexities. Yeah. It's actually the Baroque period, 1567. Ah, dang, close. Close. 0 for 3. 0 for 3. Yeah. But okay. Nice try. Well, I still appreciate you taking me through time. I've never done that before, so I uh, really appreciate it. But I do have one question. How do we get off this thing? Do you trust me? Oh! Oh! What a trip. I'm glad I trusted you. Stick around, folks. We'll be right back. Where do you want to go? Nowhere. Who do you feel like seeing? No one. Sadness. Loss of interest. Anxiety. Try Gino's Pizza! Conveniently located at the Lilydale Mall. Shop now. Shop forever. Lilydale Mall. Tell us time. Welcome back to Talk Show, folks. I'm your host. Still here with Time Traveler Guy, and thanks so much again for letting us use your time machine. It was an experience like no other. Hey, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Now, we're going to play another game here at Talk Show, using technology a little more my speed. It's called Who's On Hold? Hello? All of our representatives are currently busy. There are currently millions of people on hold at this moment. And using this phone, we're going to tap in and help them out. Time traveler guy, you ready for this? I'm ready for this. All right, let's do it. How can I help you? Oh my gosh, am I the 95th caller right now? Did I just win tickets to the Super Bowls? You're absolutely right you did. You're yes, a big winner. Thank you. Now, before we get you those sweet ticks, there's a couple of ground rules. You ready? Okay. First, you gotta get a flight to Saskatchewan. Uh, uh huh. There's a pet store down at Fifth Avenue. Uh huh. Buy a parrot. Teach that parrot the entire catalog of Soup Boy songs. Okay. And those tickets are yours. Can you do that for me, honey? Um. Anything for the Soup Boys? That's great. All right, stay on the line. We're going to get your information here. Thank you so much. I think we helped her out. I think so, too. Do you want to take one of these? I've been waiting my whole life for this. Of course, dude. I mean, I wouldn't yeah. hold you back. All right. How can I help you? Yeah, is this Gino's Pizza? Yeah, Gino's Pizza. What can I get for you? Hi, could I get a large pepperoni, please? Pepperoni? That's some real level one stuff. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Jim. Jim, 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 Jim. Come on, let's, let's step it up a little bit. Everybody orders pepperoni. You seem like a more special guy. Hey, you know what? I got one for you. I don't sell this to everybody, but this is Gino special I got for you. Okay. It's like bringing a puppy to a Super Bowl party. It's like fireworks going off, explosions. You can't keep the ladies away from you when you got the Geno special. I don't know. It sounds expensive. Expen you want to be priced into this whole thing? You can't do that. It's, you ever put gum down somewhere? You go and get it later. It's still got the flavor to it. That's a victory. That's Geno special right there. You, you know what? Forget I even mentioned it. You don't want it. Can somebody put in a pepperoni pizza whoa, for Jim whoa, whoa, here? Wait a minute. No, I, I think I really want that Gino special. Uh, all right, all right. 
Let's get you Gino special, then I'm going to send you over to Cindy in Accounting. All right, thank you so much. You're welcome, Jim. Nice job, man. I mean, yeah. holy God, right, here we go. All right, let's get to our next caller here. How can I help you? Yeah, my TV's not working. Uh, I think my cable's out. Oh, oh, no, your cable. Oh, you called the right place. Uh, uh, what are you seeing? Uh, so the screen's all fuzzy, and I'm seeing bars fuzzy. going up and down. Side to side bar. No, 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 no. I said up and down. Up and down. I'm sorry, sir. And I, I gotta ask you this. Did you try turning it off and then on again? Seriously, man, of course I did. Of course you did. I'm, so, I'm sorry, sir. Um, but this is getting a bit technical here, so I'm gonna put you on hold for just a brief moment and get you to level two support. Just a moment. Okay. Level 2 support, how can I help you? Like I was telling the last guy, I'm having troubles with my TV and my cable's out. Oh, looks like I have something in the notes here. Uh, we have bars going up and down? Yep, I got the bars. They're going up and down and the screen's fuzzy. Oh, let me add the fuzziness to the notes here. Okay. Um, sir, have you tried turning it off and then turning it back on again? Uh, of course I did. I'm just trying to watch the season finale of Two Dudes on a Couch Tonight. Oh, yeah, the one where they introduce a third guy to sit on the couch with them, but then they end up... Wait, wait, what? what? How, how, do you, how do you know? There's, wait, there's um, a third guy? I'm sorry, guy? sir, this is uh, actually quite complicated. Um, I'm going to have to give you over to uh, level three support. Thank you. Not again. Let's move on here. How can I help you? Is this Steve Robinson? Yes. We have your wife. No, my wife. Melinda. Melinda. Yeah. What do you need? Anything. I need $30 million delivered to me at the pier by midnight. $30 million? At which pier? The North Pier or the South Pier? South. South Pier. Oh, I'm pretty close to that one. Okay. Well, by midnight you said? Yes. You don't want to test me. All right, sorry. <laughs> this is a great game. Yeah, so fun. Oh, oh man. Help. Let's get right back into it. How can I help you? Thank you for reaching the GCN Corporation. Can you hold, please? Yeah. A representative will be with you shortly. Great. Welcome back to Talk Show. I'm your host. I want to sincerely thank all of you for being here tonight as we kicked off season two. We had a lot of fun, and I hope you did too. But before we go, I want to leave you with a little lullaby, and I hope you enjoy it. Good night. Go to sleep. I hope you all have pleasant dreams. Now it's time to get your rest so you'll be at, at your best. best. Don't, Don't you worry, no need, need to hurry. Good night, night dear. dear. We'll be here. Have no fear. Talk shows here. Have no fear. Talk shows here. Good night, everyone.